Hey there, I'm Debbie Dillion. I'm the horticulture extension agent here at the Union County Extension Center. Uh, I work with Master Gardeners and I'm helping out with 4-H today doing a little video on uh, fertilizer for your 4-H uh, garden kit. Uh, your, your potting soil that you use to pot up your plants had a low starter type fertilizer in the mix. So you didn't need to fertilize when you planted these uh, tomatoes, uh, basil and pepper. But you can see by looking at this, this tomato plant, um, the lower foliage is a lighter green, so it, it's starting to need some more nutrients. Because as you water these plants in these containers, the nutrients are leached out the bottom of the pot with excess water. So what you need to do for each one of these plants is add, the recipe is kind of like one and a half teaspoons for four inches of, of uh, uh, pot size diameter. So what we're going to do is we're going to put about a little bit more than a tablespoon, a tablespoon and a half of fertilizer in each of these containers. Now when you put it on, you want to sprinkle it around the edge of the pot. Uh, just lightly sprinkle it. And you can take your fingers and you can work it into the soil a little bit if you want to. Or, and or, if you've got uh, water handy, you can lightly water it in to get it down into the soil. So what I did was I just watered that in and wet it a little bit. And when you apply this fertilizer, you want your soil to be a little moist. You don't want it to be extremely dry. So if the soil is dry, water it, and then the next day, come in and apply your fertilizer. Now this fertilizer, uh, by the time you do the three pots, you want to put it down about once a month, every four weeks or so, to, to feed these plants throughout the summer. Um, and if you do that, you'll have healthy plants, you'll have good fruit production, you'll have tomatoes, you'll have basil to put in your salads and to cook with, and you'll have peppers to put in your salads or also to cook with. New or experienced gardeners alike, enjoy growing your fruits and vegetables this summer and have fun. That's the whole part of it, growing something you can eat and having fun at the same time. Don't forget to uh, post your pictures on the Family Garden Kit website and remember to sign up for the Remind app.